Hinduism has suffered too much because it got associated with politicians. So, the always the enemies of the politician, you see, once Hinduism gets associated with one group of politicians, those politicians, their enemies, naturally try to destroy not only their opponents, the Hinduism also. That is the way Hinduism has suffered too much. My effort to make Kailasa is to keep Hinduism apolitical. Let Hinduism be alive as it is in some one corner of the world. For future, because Hinduism is worthy to be kept alive for the future of the humanity. That is what is my whole effort. I am not getting involved in any controversy. I am not questioning anyone using Hinduism or using anti-Hinduism for their politics. Some are using Hinduism for their politics. Some are attacking Hinduism for their political victory. I am not getting involved in any of that. I am not going to comment any of that. I am not going to speak about any of it. I am only saying one thing. I want to keep Hinduism apolitical, alive as it is, as a pure cosmic science, enlightenment science, one corner of the world. So people who are interested in the pure enlightenment science, Hinduism, can study, get benefited, enjoy, entertain themselves, entrain themselves, enlighten themselves with Hinduism. See, some are using Hinduism to advance their political career. Some are attacking Hinduism to advance their political career. I am not talking about any of them. I am not going to comment or name or support, oppose. I am not going to get myself involved in any of it. I only want one thing. I want to keep the pure Hinduism apolitical in one corner of the world. That's all. That's it. That's all I am telling all my sons and daughters, all my kids. Study Hinduism thoroughly in depth. The core scriptures. Upanishad, Brahma Sutra, Bhagavad Gita. This three is the core scripture. Study these three books. Core values of Hinduism. Upanishads. See. Rama compiled the whole knowledge Enlightenment science, when he came into the body, he compiled the whole thing and gave, that is 108 Upanishads, Muktika Upanishad. That's Rama's gift. The next incarnation, Krishna. Whatever knowledge was present at that time, he compiled the whole thing and gave, that is Bhagavad Gita. The next incarnation, Vyasa. Whatever was available at that time, he compiled the whole thing and gave the essence, that is Vyasa Sutra, Brahma Sutras. This three is the core books of Hinduism. Study them intensely. Then you will have the base knowledge to understand Surya Siddhanta, to understand Saiva Siddhanta, to understand Vaishnava Siddhanta. To understand anything of Hinduism. I just want to keep Hinduism apolitical, alive, true to its original spirit in one corner of the world. That is the reason I am making this Kailasa happen. I am doing this Kailasa.